Hey guys, welcome back to this quick after tutorial. In today's tutorial, I will show you how to create this gradient long shadow animation. So, without any further ado, let's get started. Okay, guys, I'm gonna start with a new comp, and here I will call this gradient long shadow. I'm gonna go with full HD resolution 24 frames per second and 10 seconds as the duration. For the background color, I'm gonna go with this yellow background. You guys can copy X code if you like, and I'm gonna hit OK. Now let's add our text. So let's go to toolbar and select the text tool, and I'm gonna type a text. You guys can type whatever you like. Okay, perfect. This is my text. So I'm gonna press Ctrl or at home on my keyboard to center the anchor point. And let's use the align tool to align it to the center of the composition, like that. Now it in the center. Let's duplicate this text. So I'm gonna select this and press Ctrl D to duplicate this text layer. Now let's drop this down like that i'm gonna pre-compose this layer so this will be our main uh, long shadow composition so i'm gonna right click select this pre-compose option so this will bring this pre-compose dialog so i'm gonna call this long shadow just like that okay i will pick this move all attributes into new composition option and then i'm gonna hit okay like that now it in the new composition now let's go to main composition i'm gonna go to effect and preset menu if you guys don't see this you can always go windows and here you can find effect and preset i'm gonna search cc radiable effect so i'm gonna type cc radiable select this cc radiable and select this layer and then double click to apply the effect if you don't see effect control you can also find it in the window menu okay now i'm gonna select the type to straight zoom and then increase the amount like that i'm gonna also increase the quality so it will not pixelated okay perfect now i'm gonna select this center anchor point let's zoom out a little bit and then place this anchor point right here as you can see when we move this also long shadow will be moved as you can see right now long shadow is a little bit soft so i need to increase the contrast so i'm gonna add a level effect so go to effect and preset and search for level and i'm gonna select this level effect and then double click to apply the level effect now i'm gonna set this to alpha channel and then increase this slider to left like that this will increase the contrast of this text now i will also add a gradient ramp effect if you guys want a flat color you can apply fill effect but i need this to be a gradient effect so i'm gonna apply a gradient ramp effect okay i'm gonna just double click you guys can give any color you like for this star color and the in color so i'm gonna pick this color if you guys want to apply my color you can just copy this hex code okay and i'm gonna just okay Okay, perfect as you can see now we have this nice gradient long shadow now we can also animate this by using this radiable uh, center point so i'm gonna go to zero second and then create a new keyframe for the center anchor point and then i'm gonna select this long shadow composition and then press u on my keyboard to reveal the all the anchor point just like that now let's go to maybe four second and then just select this cc radio blur effect so this will show up our anchor point and i'm gonna drag this to right of the composition like that now we have this simple animation so i'm gonna press n on my keyboard to in the composition here now let's go to zero second and then press space bar to preview our animation as you can see now we have this nice radiant long shadow animation and that's basically it and i hope you guys enjoyed this as always thank you so much for the patreon supporters i wish you guys in the next one peace